Welcome to Pop Turnative, where we dive into topical discussions from the worlds of pop culture, social media, and sports. Here is your host, Peter Romoliotis, aka PD Beats. Simon, good to see you. Welcome back to the show, man. Thank you so much for having me. It's exciting. I mean, episodes of season two of From are kind of rolling out on MGM+. Plus. I mean, I wanted to know what was it like officially returning to film season two, Simon. What was that like for you? Oh, I was so pumped to meet the new castmates and my other castmates and the directors. I loved working with Jack Bender and getting to surf in Nova Scotia again and just getting to do all the fun things in Nova Scotia. And I was so excited to see everyone again and... If you could have seen my face when I saw those cast, it was so, like, it was just such a excited, loving face. Yeah, 100%. And it's interesting because we all know that, you know, season one leaves us with so many questions and so many kind of, you know, freaky things happened. You know what I mean? So when you officially kind of start getting the scripts for season two, seeing what's going to happen with Colony House and the Matthews family, what's that like kind of reading the first couple of scripts, Simon? I'm curious about that. Oh, so there's actually, we were, we're so pumped when you get a script because John doesn't like to tell many secrets. So there's like two so funny stories. Like there's no, we don't take phones to the dinner table and we never have notifications on. But we know when we know a script's going to drop, we turn them on and we literally stopped eating dinner to read the <laughs> script. And when we were at the beach, we got a notification and we're like under the umbrella and we're like trying to read it because it's sunny at the beach because it's Nova Scotia so and it's in the summertime so it's really hot and sunny. So we're under that like beach umbrella and then we're like, I want to see what's happening. I want to see what's happening. So <laughs> we're so pumped when we have it because and when whenever it ends, that because the best part's when it ends and you're so excited to get the new one. Yeah, and I mean, Simon, I mean, and I feel like this is very hard to do because I'm a big fan of the show. Season two is scarier than season one. Like, how is that possible? <laughs> yeah, it is so scary. The, fir the first couple of episodes, they were so, so scary. I was like, I, because it was also a while ago so from season two. It was yep. almost a year ago when we started filming it and it's the first two episodes. So I'm like, mom, what's going to happen? And then after, it's like, and then once you see Smiley on the bus, you're like, you know what's going to happen. You're like, oh, <laughs> that always, always when you see that smile, you know something's going to happen. You know something's going to happen. And like I said, you know, episodes are, we're, we're getting into a lot of kind of the big things that are happening now with everything. So many questions and everything. Now it's two seasons where you're, you've played this character, Ethan Matthews, Simon. So I'm just wondering, you know, because the first season you're getting to know this character. You've never played this character before. And, but now I feel like, you know, there's a possibility that you have more of a grasp and understanding of this character. What do you like the most about Ethan Matthews? What do you like about this character the most? I love how he thinks of like everything like a challenge or a quest and I love playing Ethan how he's just like an innocent little boy that's like my dream character to play I love playing him so much and he has such a great attitude how he's like like there's some scenes where he's like oh so we try again and we do that and he just never gives up on his craft he's just so pumped and he's so passionate about to do it the Ethan Victor scenes are obviously great scenes, but also... Oh, I love those scenes so <laughs> but much. But I also like the Ethan Jade scenes. We get some cool Ethan Jade scenes this season. <laughs> those were so funny. I was laughing at one for, like, so long. <laughs> and I want to know, because even in our first interview, we did talk about the thriller kind of horror perspective of this, because at the end of the day, it is a series in the genre of, like you know, the popularity of horror movies and everything. And I want to know because, you know, you get to work with a lot of incredible storytellers on this. You, the scripts are amazing, the writing and just the cinematography. What is your favorite thing about being on From on MGM Plus? Do you know, do you have something that, you know, stands out compared to other things that's your favorite thing about being part of the show? Yeah, I love the people on. They're so, they're so nice. They're so supportive of you. 
And I really, okay, what I love about the show is, of course, my character. I love my character so much. And the storyline in general, like, it's such a good, like, the Matthews family, like, how they got there and what they've been through. It's just such a loving storyline. And I, I kind of feel bad for the family, but at least they're together. And I love acting on that show. It is such a good show. And I just love it so much. Hannah, who plays your sister, she still blames the Matthews family for everything that's happening. Do we blame the Matthews family for everything that's happening? I don't know if you can blame them. I think just the timing. You guys showed up and everything just got so chaotic. <laughs> yeah, I think that, okay, at least they didn't show up like when Donna showed up when yeah. I was at my That would Yes, it did go pretty crazy when they came in, but I don't think it's their fault. I think it's just, like, there's a time that stuff happens. Like, when it's all it's just, like, smooth, and then as someone goes high, and then someone goes in. You can't blame it for them. Like, when Megan opened the door, you can't blame the map. <laughs> wrong place, there. wrong time, right, Simon? I think that's yes. what... <laughs> Definitely wrong place, that's for sure. It, it is. It's it's so crazy, and it's so it's so cool to see... You know, the quest was something that, you know, Ethan was really involved with and obsessing at times with in season one. He's still all about the quest, right? Like, nothing has changed there. Like, he's still about finishing the quest, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. He's still... There's a very heart-to-heart -heart scene with him and Donna, but I'm not going to say any spoilers, but... um. Yeah, he's he's still on the quest. He still loves his quest. He's still He still has the quest stick which means he's really into the quest and he's still he's still so loving with Victor and he still loves Victor so much even though he might be mad at him he's there's there's always this peace and this peace always holds on to it even though Victor's mad at him he he they're still friends with each other Ethan he's kind of confused at Victor but he they're both still friends and that's just that's what I love about it it's pretty cool that epi like people are finally able to see season two, right? Like you film it, you wait, you wait, and episodes are rolling out. It's so exciting, right, for you and the cast, your family, for episodes to finally be out. Yeah, it's so exciting. Like, and to see the final product and to see what's there and what's not, it's so cool to finally see it. And I like how I know what you know. It's like it was a long time, but there's still some piece I remember. Like how can how can I forget the jade scenes, and I can't forget the smiley scenes. So I know when to cover my eyes oh and my stuff. Oh my god! So. Oh my goodness! <laughs> That's so it's so scary. Like, I, and like season one was so scary, and I'm watching the first three episodes of of season two, and I'm like, oh my goodness! Like they did the impossible. They made it scarier than the first season. So I know. Like, <laughs> it's. That's crazy, all the stuff that happened in the two first nights. You know, the Matthews family came out a bad time, but I think the bus people came out a way worse time. I know, and, and you know, episodes rolling out on MGM Plus Season 2 of From. Simon, so good catching up. Thank you for coming back on the show, man. I really appreciate it. And thank you so much for having me. Once again, the pleasure is all mine. Uh, awesome. Well, this has been Pop Turn of YouTube.com slash Pop Turn for previous episodes. Simon Webster, of course, plays Ethan Matthews in From Season 2. Episodes are rolling on MGM+. Plus. Until next time, this is Simon and Beauty Beats signing off. Thank you for tuning in to Pop Turnative. Make sure to check out our past episodes of Pop Turnative on YouTube. Be sure to like Pop Turnative on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. This has been an Autograph Communications production.